Hey guys, it's Bianca from Plan, Live, and Travel. How are you today? So today I think I'm gonna show you guys what I've been using right now to organize my stickers. Subject to change. I've seen a couple of other, they're shop owners, but I've seen a couple of shop owners and other um, YouTubers when I type in sticker storage. They have like this basket thing and they have like tabs and they go through and do it that way i'm curious i'm curious only because i'm in a camper we move around a lot i thought having it in a more contained environment would be better but oh my gosh you guys it is look at all my, my stuff sticking out um it is definitely a lot it is it is but it's not as bad as it used to be. I kind of like cut down a lot. But anyways, let's get into it. So right here I have like a couple of these. I just started decorating them. Um, so what I do is like this one has like anything that has to do like with the month. Maybe travel. Here's Disney, Universal. Okay, you guys, shop owners, if anybody's watching, I need more Universal stuff. I go to Universal more than Disney, which... It's not like I go every day, but I love Universal. Just saying. We have we show Disney a lot of love. We need to show some Universal some love. I mean, who doesn't like the minions? Anywho, we have the weather. Camping, which is funny because it's in a different section too. And we have birthdays. So then we have the holidays or countdowns, that kind of stuff. And then it goes into Pacific holidays. So we have like Valentine's Day. Easter, Mother's Day, Father's Day, 4th of July, summer, fall, all last fall, Halloween, then you have winter, and then Christmas, New Year's, and then the wacky holidays, which I absolutely love. So, then what I have in this one is basically, I took it, the other one out, but... So I was thinking about filming my plan with me. I'll just shove it back in. So here I have my lineup, mostly only for the month. Depends how thick this gets, because it has to stay on my shelf out here. So I have, you know, the organizer. So this is for um, what I'll be doing a plan with me. So week of January 16th through the 22nd. Then I have... This could be like a January, what, kit lineup. It's the end of January. On um, the 23rd through the 29th. And then I have a February monthly from Planner Pixie Co. This is from Leonard Designs, Leonard Designs, Leonard Designs, Leonard Designs. Whew. But yeah. And then this is on the back is where I keep the scripts for the, and also extra date dots from Savannah Paper Co. But to organize it now to organize the rest of the <laughs> the rest of the year is in a big three ring binder i will grab that in a second i'm just grabbing what i have next to me and we're going to start from there so the other binders that i have like i said so now i have three more of these that are just your normal icons stickers scripts that kind of stuff so we have the budget payday work late on call work late and this has to do with my um this is a custom script from savannah paper co where i talk to my recruiter extend the contract and renew license i have to renew my surgical tech license every two years so that's what that is then we have um planning new releases happy mail organized stickers we have the to-do section, to buy, next week, canceled. I really need to move my gratitude right here because that's one of the things I like to put on my sidebar. And this is like sidebar kind of stuff other than the canceled. So I really need to find it and move it there. Next, we have laptops, calling. We have Disney. This is all like, and that, this is the thing about this, to keep it. Not so I have to flip through so many pages. A lot of times when you see like, oh, this is phone. So this will have like FaceTime, phone icons, that kind of stuff. A script that says call mom. 
this one is all TV. So when I pull it out, I know all my TV section is here. So I'll have Disney Plus, TV icons. Then I have like from Sweet Quiet Designs, um, Netflix, Hulu, Prime, extra of these. Normally the extra ones, the duplicates, like if I buy more than one sheet, I'll put it in the back. And then football, Prime, again, these are in the back because they're extras. So I have that. And then I have YouTube. Part of YouTube is um, true crime. So I have a bunch of scripts for true crime. Movie nights. And then it goes into like TV shows. So these are older TV shows. Um, Big Bang, Shark Week. That we kind of started but didn't really finish. Like, I don't know. Maybe because not every day I want to be educated on sharks. But it's such a cool show, though, too. So, I don't know. 90 Day Fiance. I still have to figure out where that is that I can watch. We don't have cable or anything. So, if it's on a streaming service, let me know. Um, that Singer. Obviously, Wednesday, I also have another sheet that I keep with me. So, when I do my daily, I can use the stickers up. Um, cause I actually got these after I started watching it. Cause you don't know if you're going to like it or not. So why buy the sticker? But still Wednesday is awesome. So if you haven't seen it, please do. If you like murder mystery, it's awesome. Nailed it. If you guys haven't seen that, that's hilarious. It's on Netflix. Next is like headphones to go into like pot list me listening to podcasts or my audio books. Next is Disney. So here's a list of Disney movies. Um, Disney characters. Then we have Star Wars. We love Star Wars. DC Marvel and apparently Harry Potter. So I might have to like separate it a little bit. I don't know. It's a weird selection there. Or I could put Harry Potter in Universal Land. Actually, that's not actually not a bad idea. Bowling. Um, because I went bowling a few times and I was like, I need bowling scripts or icons, and I went crazy. So there you go. Now I have them. We have Mario gaming, game night, and then we have shopping and errands. So basically Target run, which is the big chunk of my shopping experience. <laughs> it's Target. And then we have um, running errands, Fox and Pip. I have like a blonde one for my sister, redhead for my si other sister, and then I have another brunette for my mom. And then of course, sweet quiet designs if I'm just gonna do friends. So that's it for this one. And we have extra, um, stickers right here that I guess I, I didn't know where to put so <laughs> I feel like that's life I didn't know where to put the sticker so I'm just gonna shove it here story of my life okay so next magic of eye is the astrology planner that I got recently it's really really good my desk area is a mess okay so quarantine Damn, I could have actually used those. Vince got COVID. We Vince finally got COVID. Like, we haven't gotten COVID this whole entire time. Vince gets COVID. I'm in the house with him, and I'm still testing negative. Once I had symptoms, I didn't go to work. But um, I never, I still haven't gotten it. I don't know why. Knock on wood. But it's weird. I don't know. Anywho, we have some and stickers. So this is my food and emotions because I feel like food and emotions kind of go together, you know? And this is like the biggest one of them all too. Like she's pretty thick. So first we have bubble tea, Slurpee run, adult drinks. So beer, wine, basically White Claws. So what I did was I actually put just the icons or like the, the characters first and then I did the scripts second so coffee's almost the same way unless it came together so hot cocoa's on the back my healthy green shake which you know <laughs> if I have a lot of stickers it's kind of telling me something right you know like <laughs> have I been doing it no the pink drink from Starbucks is one of my favorites that if it's not coffee related I love the pink drink they also have a violet drink it's really good Next, custom strips, scripts from Savannah Paper Co. I love my coffee and breakfast. It's literally right, right in my planner. So I was like, I need this as a script. 
So that's what that is. And if I do a, a certain breakfast, like if I write in my planner, like avocado toast, I'll still use this script and then just pull an icon or a doodle that would match it. And it'll go right next to it. So we have um, other breakfast items. We have lunch, dinner. This is like grocery run, curbside pickup, Costco, Sam's, all that jazz. Then you have the icons for, you know, groceries and doodles and that kind of stuff. Food, snacks, drinks. This is a custom script. Um, new drinking hole, out to eat. Um... I need to start using these more often. Sometimes I forget. <laughs> but now that I'm like filming, I want to use up more of my stickers. But sometimes I get lazy when I do my memory spread and I just like, I forget. Um, For some reason, <laughs> I was starving one day and I was like, I don't have anything to market. <laughs> so that's where that came from. When you're super full and you have your food belly, which is me all the time. But anyways, eating out. Um, here's a mix. You have Indian, barbecue, Mexican, Hawaiian, mac and cheese. This is actually kind of before I went vegan. Um, but I can actually make all these, those type of meals vegan. So it's fine. Then we have meal plan, the plates. So this I might want to separate and probably get a new sleeve for. Farmer's market. So then we have burgers and dogs. So you have like Burger King, you know, burgers and hot dogs. You have the Asian section. So it's a either ramen, um, bao buns, anything like that. Then you have Panera. You have, I put international slash pasta because there was also other things in here that was, oh, I thought, maybe not. Maybe it's just pasta. No, like there's non bread and that kind of stuff. Super good. All sandwiches, whether it's, a normal sandwich or this gyro, gyro, hero, whatever you want to call it. Pizza, taxa, um, ta tacos, and Mexican. So I know Taco Bell isn't Mexican, but that's why I have it under tacos. There's some like burritos and enchiladas in there too. We got some avocado happening, avocado toast, loving some avocado. Didn't like avocados before, fun fact about me. Did not like avocados or guacamole before I went vegan. I'm telling you, when you do an extreme change of, I don't want to say diet, lifestyle, or how you're eating, your taste buds change, because they say that about pregnant people. I'm not pregnant, but I like my guac now. Sweets. So anytime I want to mark like cookies or I bake something, then I have my vegan sweets right here. Next is my people slash emotion section. So here we have with hubby hanging out. So that's like technically me, um, my, my two sisters. I thought that was super cute. And then sister time. And then family time. It says in my feelings. I'm getting new scripts from Savannah Paper Co. They haven't come yet. It's going to be the biggest order I think I've ever placed. It has 64 sticker um scripts sh sheets and i re um she redid the ones for that says vince mom one of my other friends and twinsy which is her so super excited to add those to that side in my feelings i wrote mix only because like this is like the mix sheet for it so any like random sheet um, positive, like today was a good day, just breathe, that kind of thing. Dates, so date night, friend, friend night, or friend date, whatever, any kind of date related there. Then you also, oh, maybe not, maybe this is just dates, and then here is BFF, friends, double date, that kind of stuff. This is a not happy, I have a lot of not happy ones. <laughs> Work? Work? Let me know in the comments down below if anybody else is like that, that you feel like work is mostly the non-happy moments, I swear. Next is like, um, stay in your lane, kind of sassy, but I also have like another section that's sassy. So this is more like, I don't know, my aggravation, I guess. Um, Hot Mess Express, um, you guys can read that. I don't know, I don't, I want to, I don't want to curse on my YouTube channel. I'm going to try to be good. Anyways, oh, this is Monday. 
and then you have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. I just thought that was cute. This is my sassy section, so zero fox given. Thought that was super cute. Here lies my last final F. So yeah, that's my sassy section. Here's gratitude. Gratitude needs to move because I get why it's here in the emotions, but I don't think to check here. So this needs to be moved to the other to do and that kind of stuff. This is sick and hurt, period, which I don't suffer from my periods anymore now that I have the shot. So that's nice. I don't have to worry about it. But once in a while, I will get cramps and I can mark it. Tired. Always tired. Um, oh, that just like pulled right out. I'll fix that later. Anxiety. Rush. Like if there's a busy day at work and you're just like, ah, that's what that is. Um, these are just heads. I would normally have them with a mix, but the mix is like a little different. So this is just like, you know, heads. I don't know. Scare clearance and hooray happy clearance. So that is food and emotions. I'm running out of space. You guys, we have one more of this type. So here are some more stickers. There's nothing on the back. Okay. So. Some random milestone, which should be with the the year one. Okay, so here we have the cat stuff. You can't even see. That's fantastic. All right, so here's the cat stuff. So paws, um, heartworm, their food, um, vet appointment, meds, trim nails, that kind of stuff. Then you have the actual, I divided up the cat. So here's all of Annabelle, um, bean sprouts did i don't know if she still does it or not but i sent her pictures and i paid for custom so that is annabelle and then there's my cow kitty luna super cute and then i also have these random cat stickers that i got and other animals so back in oh god i don't even remember what year that was when australia had that nasty fire a lot of shops were doing um fundraising so that that script or that script that sticker kit from the munchkins um that's what that was and we have ladybugs for spring i don't know some random cats with glasses look at the sloth that's so cute all right next we have hiking going outdoors walking working out don't really work out we try to walk around the campground right now it's just been raining crazy in California oh my god I'm over it granted I'd rather take rain than fire but I'm over it I need to I want to explore and I'm I can't do it in the rain who is outside my camper talking I don't know I can't see anybody but there's people talking anyhow it's like don't they know I'm filming activity explore new place explore discover um i need to do that more often use those scripts next is car related i have some of these scripts also in my monthly planner that i got from um aaron condren which keeps track of the camper the truck the jeep all that jazz so a lot of that is also in there as well so i can mark when it is and that kind of stuff so this is just here so like if we go for a drive or whatever if we did that i'll mark it in my planner too drive to drive all day mini road trip the camper scripts oh my god how do i keep saying scripts doodles i love them they're so cute those this is not my camper this is basically a travel trailer mine's a big fifth wheel but it's so cute <laughs> i'll take it um pack up camper new spot open slides campfire I'm gonna probably make another sleeve for the fire because I think I'm getting scripts and more icons for that. Next is Me Day. Me Day is filled with a lot of stuff, you guys. Um, Me Day, I don't even know why I label it like that. Face masks for sure, facial, nails, hair, bath time, spa day, massages, doing your makeup, mini spa day. I mean, it's a lot, so we just, it's all about me. It's my day. So I've been doing a lot of face masks. I haven't gotten much facial since I've been here to Cali. Um, I'll have to find a spot. Do it. Contacts. 
to remind me to switch out my contacts. Laundry, chores and general um, reminders like change water filters, that kind of stuff. But it's like like clean bathroom, kitchen, that kind of stuff. Sleep in or can't sleep slash lazy days. So I might have to break this up a little bit. Because sleep in and can't sleep, yes. Lazy day, I think, might be separate. Then you have like early start. You have alarms, wax melts, the audio books, and then regular books. Because I was going to try to like read physical books and it's just not working for my brain. I auto book. Audible works really well for me because I can do other things but still listen to the story and I'm still retaining it. It's awesome. Next is meds. Normally, I just mark it for my birth control because it's the only, only med I take. Believe it or not. Okay. So, that's that for that kind of stuff. Now, this, waiting for something to fall. This I kind of want to redo. I ordered another sticker book from Savannah Paper Co. And then I got these sleeves, these organizers. They're the dividers that go into these. So I'm saving it until I get my order from her. These are both hers. This was one that was completely empty that she gave me when I went to go visit her. And um, I started it backwards, as you can see. I didn't realize it until I already started using it for stickers so I was just like F it it's staying so what I like to do with leftover stickers or um well they are stickers Bianca thanks for being specific but doodles scripts anything like that that I only had a few left I like to put them in here that way I intend to pull this out first before I get my binders out because you want to use up these, right? So that's kind of my thing. So I have it divided up. Um, like payday, paying bills, TV shows, and that kind of stuff. So the only thing is, is that, again, it's really dense. It's really like all together. Like TV shows is also with gaming. So I got more dividers in another book because I really want to kind of um separate it because some of these are really full where I can't put any more and it's not being organized so so that's what I also like to do this one kind of has like other more icons I should say I mean they're still doodles but you know so this I was trying to like organize but as you see like birthday kind of got with laundry because when you turn the page it already has like the food section so this is why I kind of want to definitely go back through and reorganize. I've also started using this for um, my plans with me's. So I'll pull out the sticker since I'm going back to filming. Before I didn't, I would just pull as I go. But now I'll have it more organized where I can like actually do a better YouTube job. Yay. Go me. All right. Now how I organize my foil at this moment is sad so I have two of these sticker books basically so these are all like the colorful ones um I think it's just like just a color like there's no theme to it it's just colors of different randomness beautiful right so that's that one. This one's more for Pacific. Like this is like happy birthday. These have hearts. So Valentine's Day. You have um, St. Patrick's Day. Um, any quotes? Um, rainy day. Mermaid kind of theme or underwater beach theme. Flowers. So that's what's in here. Those are freebies. Then you get into Halloween. Thanksgiving, winter, which I have a lot. And then that was um, New Year's. And then like this foil was obviously Christmas, like red and green. I don't know when, unless there's like an everyday kit that would have those colors that's on Christmas. I don't know. So I threw that in here. Um, Crest press, good vibes. So you have like butterflies and peace signs. There is a rainbow in here. So I don't know why rainbows over here, but whatever stars and moons, lux, 
the alien one. So that's what's in this one. Oh my gosh, you guys. I have this random thing too that I keep all of my day extenders and extra washi, um, washi glitter headers. And it all fits. Oh my gosh, my planner will fall. That's my memory spread. My monthly planner. So it all fits in this like little shelf thing to keep it all organized within my other shelf. So I just like throw all this back and then the one that has my kits fits in here too and then this goes right here and we're here so i'm gonna show you guys real quick what my sticker kits look like it's a big three ring binder hold please all right and we're back so <laughs> i'm only gonna show you one of these real quick the other one is basically a three ring binder that's three inches as well. And it's holding sticker kits that I haven't assigned to a week yet. So here I have some that are assigned to a week. And that's basically, I kind of want to flip through so you don't see February because I kind of want to do a February kind of thing. So we're going to skip, even though you just saw some of it. Um... But yeah, so basically I just throw stickers in here. Like if I had foil, like this was, um, cause I don't have a kit to go with this yet. Um, I have an old kit here, God, years ago, um, from Scribble Prints Co that's in here. So, um, sometimes if I know like, okay, like St. Patrick's Day is the 17th, I'll put the foil here if I have it. And then moving on. So like I also try to stick in my monthlies in here. So it's basically like, again, here's Easter. I had, I found that kit. This is also an older kit. And then I also have um, foil here waiting for a kit. So like I said, it's just a bunch of kits that I had before. So for this one right here, this I specifically got for our trip to San Francisco when we did the whole friends exhibit. But then I realized that I've already planned out that week because it was, I used um, New Year's kit for that. So I think once we start rewatching friends, this is gonna be moved. And then I'll just add pictures from our experience to it, so. Um, yeah, some of these are blank, like I don't have a main monthly, um, Cinco de Mayo. I try to write down like important, like either birthdays or like holidays that are happening and see, I knew I had this already. I just got this in the D stash. So this will be D stashed because I did get it. But anyways, so I just started filling it out like it goes all the way through like fall but obviously in December but not all of these are filled in but this would be for the whole year so that's kind of cool that it will fit the whole year granted if you had all the stickers maybe not because I mean she's still closed like there's still some space but not a whole lot but Anyways, that's how I do my sticker kits. You guys are gonna have to let me know. Look at this, isn't that pretty? I forgot where I got that from, but it says Bianca Plants. Anyways, guys, let me know down in the comments down below. How do you guys organize your stickers? Which way do you like better? Um, I am still debating whether or not I wanna get that basket and put in the stickers that way. So far, my binders have been working. It's definitely like when you're trying to do your memory spread, it definitely takes a good amount of time. But then again, like I use that time to listen to true crime podcasts. So I don't know. But let me know down below what you guys do to organize your stickers. Um, hope this video was helpful. Let me know down below. I hope you guys have a great day or night whenever you guys are watching this. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.